Hey loves, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I just thought to start this vlog today because tomorrow is going to be crazy busy for me. I'm going to fill you guys in. But you guys, I am so stressed. <laughs> I've had the longest day. Go and eat your food. Now, go and finish your food. See this girl. Oh. <laughs> Tiara, grandma is calling you. Go and finish your food. Oh God. As I was saying, you guys, I've had the longest and the most stressful day. I've been in the kitchen since morning. I just closed out. Did I close out that vlog? I don't know, but I just finished cooking for a particular vlog. I'm sure that vlog should have been up by now. So I had to make jollof rice. Everyone is already eating right now, and I'm running back to go and finish my food. But I just thought to start this vlog. Like I said, tomorrow is going to be crazy busy. So I thought to make jollof rice for the family because I'm going to be out tomorrow. And... They're going to have this for lunch tomorrow, even though we're eating it right now. You guys, rice is one of the food that we eat almost every day <laughs> in a Nigerian home. So I'm going to London tomorrow and I'm leaving super, 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 super early. I'm going to see my girl Tele and I can't wait to carry you guys along. I know that I'll be leaving super early, so I might not be able to start this vlog. Hence why I'm starting this vlog now. I also have a brunch to attend tomorrow in Bradford. So... <sighs> tomorrow is already looking crazy but let's just see how it goes i just thought to start the vlog so i'll carry you guys along and if you've not subscribed please subscribe like comment share and subscribe this vlog promises to be an interesting one can you guys see the sun on my skin can you guys see the sun on my skin i am stressed but i don't look like it see guys ignore my hair this is what i look like on a typical saturday i am so stressed <laughs> go finish your food the next day Losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe I just got to London I'm going to pick up the camera real quick And speak to you guys in a bit Just give me a second believe There's something That'll give you relief There's something that'll have what you need What you need Hey loves, oh my god I literally just woke up You guys, ignore how I look I slept, it's been a journey I'm on my way back home I apologize See, I thought I was going to carry you guys along And vlog so much But it was impossible At some point I got really busy And my camera was the last thing on my mind But let me just fill you guys in Because I don't think I mentioned So today was Teller's baby's dedication And we had to go to church Because Ariel called and we had to be there for her and today was just really beautiful I'm thankful to God for her life and oh God announcement <laughs> I'm thankful to God for her life and it was just beautiful to reconnect I haven't seen Tele in God knows when it's been so long so it was just an opportunity for us to just catch up even though it was short but we made the most out of it. I'm on my way home now. You guys, I told you guys yesterday that I have a brunch to attend. God, it is so late. I don't even know if I can still make it, but let's just see how this vlog play out. I don't know if I'm going to go home first. All right, I think that's all. <laughs> that announcement was too long. I kept waiting for it to end. So, um, see you guys, I have lost my line of thought. God, what was I even saying before? I'll pick up the vlog much later. I wanted to just fill you guys in and update you guys on how my day has been. Today has been so beautiful. I'm so happy. I'm glad I actually went out today. So, I'll see you guys much later. If I end up going for the brunch, you guys will see in the vlog. I'll probably put a clip here. And yeah, whatever I get up to, you guys will definitely find out. So, I'll see you guys much, much later. Not 
to wear my hoodie oh my god hope you guys can hear me how are you guys doing so it's the next day oh my god yesterday was an adventure oh my god i had the most amazing time yesterday you guys saw that i went for see at this point it was dinner when i got there it felt like the party was just starting <laughs> i had so much fun yesterday and i realized that we have an african no a nigerian restaurant in bradford like this thing about not going out is crazy if you don't go out you won't know what we have i found a nigerian restaurant and their food oh my god I had jollof rice and chicken it was good and turkey sorry it was good they sell amala pounded yam egusi and i was also able to taste nigerian fanta i missed it so much it was so good to reconnect and also just have fun so i just thought to pick up the vlog i'm just on my way back from school you guys you know when they say the spirit is willing but the body is weak that was me this morning i struggled to get out of bed but i did eventually i had to go to school because i had things to do and i'm just on my way home i just thought to pick up the vlog and update you guys so i'll see you guys much much later i'm climbing the hill and i'm already out of breath <laughs> you guys this toddlers here let me just place my camera here so that we can just these toddlers are the smartest yes tiara you are hungry okay i'm making food don't underestimate them see this tiara has eaten this morning no she has had breakfast this morning i'm about to make toast for myself and she's saying she's hungry so she's going to eat with me but that's not even why i picked up this camera let me tell you guys why i picked up the camera i was saying that these toddlers are very very smart and don't underestimate them so whenever i don't know if you guys watched one of the vlogs where i said i had to run i i, I always run out of the house because I don't want Tiara to see me going out because whenever she sees me going out, she wants to go out with me. And you guys, most times I'm not even in the mood to, <laughs> to push any stroller. So I always just run out and come back in. So of late, I think she has noticed my routine. Abby, she has learned my routine. Now, whenever she sees that I wake up in the morning and she sees that I start doing things in a hurry, this girl start following me up and down. This morning, okay, so I have somewhere to be this morning and um, I, I just had my bath. I want to quickly eat before I leave. On a norm, she would eat and probably stay with grandma. But for some reason, she followed me to the bathroom. I said, Tiara, I want to use the toilet. She said, no, no, no. You guys, kiss your privacy goodbye. <laughs> Kiss your privacy goodbye because these toddlers will stress you. They will test you. I said, Tiara, I want to shower. She said, no. No, mommy. No. Why? Because she already knows or she's already sensing that I'm about to leave the house. You guys, I don't have my privacy. <laughs> Even my phone is not my phone anymore. So I have another phone. I have a Samsung phone that I usually use. So one time I just played... Um, Coco Melon on the phone for her, you guys. That was in nine back in Nigeria. Ever since then, that phone became Tiara's phone. She had a tab, but it broke. So I started giving her my phone. Ever since then, that phone is Tiara's phone. If I say Tiara, go and bring my phone, she will bring the two of them. Mommy's phone, Tiara's phone. I'm like, how? Where? When? When did this happen? How did this happen? I told her that, see, you have to replace my phone because your child has taken over everything I own. You guys, even down to food. You cannot eat your food in peace. <laughs> God, these toddlers, you guys, don't underestimate them. Don't ever underestimate them. They are so smart. They are too smart. Smarter than their age. Especially these pandemic babies, you guys. I had Tiara during the pandemic. These pandemic babies, I don't know. They are not, ah, no, 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 no. The other day I was in an Uber and I was with Tiara. So myself and the Uber driver, we got talking. So he asked me how old is Tiara. I said, she's two plus. He said, oh, when did you have her? I said, 2020. He said, oh my God, I also had my twins, 2020. And I think he had them in June, but I had Tiara in July. So he was telling me that, how do I cope? That these pandemic babies, they're too smart. They know how to operate his phone. He does not have his privacy. He does not even have a life. <laughs> And I was like, tell me about it. Tell me about it because that is my reality. It is so funny. It is beautiful. Don't get me wrong. Like when you see these changes and you see them do things that originally they're not meant to do at their age because they are very smart. But at the same time, I'm like, can you just grow 
bit by bit. Don't grow faster than yourself. I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. I feel like I'm, I'm talking too much, but I hope you guys get what I'm saying. So I want to make toast. I recently started making my toast a special way. Maybe I'll show you guys. Oh, let me do for Tiara. I forgot she said she wanted. Probably I'll show you guys. And finally, guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Your girl is making her hair in two days. <laughs> I'm making my hair soon. I've had my wig on for almost three weeks and you guys, it's been, it's not been easy. Whenever I have my wig on, for some weird reason, I always have a headache. And I was talking to Toby, was it yesterday? And she was saying that, oh yes, it used to happen to her, her it used to happen to her as well. So now I know that it's not just gifts, it's not just my thing. And I'm just tired, you guys, always thinking of straightening my hair, coiling my hair, making it look nice, and the wind is not even helping matters. You straighten your hair, once you go outside, it's already looking like you're not doing anything to your hair. I'm done with that life. <laughs> So I'm making my hair in two days. Um, I just booked an appointment, but I'm making my hair with someone different. You guys see this thing about UK braiders here. Yeah? I feel like they are too pricey. They are too expensive, but they don't give you what you really want. And I'm just over it. If I'm going to spend money, I should at least spend money and see and like enjoy it or spend money and see the results Yeah, Toby is very busy, so she can't make my hair this time. So I found someone else. So it's my first time using this person she was recommended on my class group chat so i'm hoping that she does she makes the hair really nice i want to do ghana weaving and i just want something that i don't have to stress about something i don't have to pack just ghana weaving so that i know that my hair is there and it looks nice and i don't have to do anything so i think the next clip you guys will probably see might be me going to make my hair i don't know let's just see how the vlog plays out i don't know if i'm going to pick up the vlog tomorrow because i have school tomorrow and Oh, I'm not even looking forward to it, you guys. I am not looking forward to it. So um, I'll show you guys my toast and I'll see you guys much, much later. <laughs>